time to break out of jail. That is, the Walmart ball jail. You also need some green reindeer moss. Start by spray painting the Walmart ball with moss green spray paint. Separate the large pieces and stretch out any chunks that are thick. With a can of general spray adhesive, spritz a small portion of the ball with the adhesive. Take a small patch of green moss and press it onto the ball in the sticky area. Press and hold for a few seconds to make sure it sticks. Continue to spray the ball and attach the green moss to the outside. Once you cover the entire ball with spray adhesive and moss, give the entire moss covered ball an overall coat of the spray adhesive. Style it in a woven basket for a textured boho look. Place in a low colored glass bowl for a more modern look. And for a traditional look, a large ceramic pot is perfect for this moss covered ball. I found one of these larger ones for $2.50. We're going to be using this vinyl tablecloth. So we're just going to gather up our fabric. We're going to take our scissors and cut it off. I'm actually going to string two zip ties together. And what we're going to do is gather our fabric. So now that we have our little cluster of fabric secured, what we can do then is take our zip tie and tie it off. Cut the excess zip tie off. All I've been doing is just pulling a little bit piece by piece of the top until we have that nice pleating. So we're just going to snip all of that excess off. Take our ribbon. I'm just going to take it and place it right here and secure it once more with a zip tie. Now it's time to add some flowers. Dip them in our glue skillet and I'm placing it on the inside of this. So now we cut off the individual leaves and what we can do then is just poke them right in. So then we can take a few more of these wisteria stems. Now we have some of these beautiful pink roses and here is the finished ball. You can do this in different colors for different seasons and holidays and varied sizes for added texture.